We all love music. Music is an important part of our life and now we basically listen to music everywhere we go. When I was young, if you wanted to listen to music outside of your own house, you had to bring with you this music cassette with their own reader. Then there were CDs with CDs player and then we had the MP3 reader. I actually may still have one, let me check. Yep, here it is. We had to download all the music on the computer and then put the music from the computer into these little things that you would bring with you if you wanted to listen to music. Now we're so lucky that we just can't listen to music on our own phone and the only thing that we have to bring with us are headphones. During the last couple of years I have tried many different type of headphones and to this date I have my favorite. Favorite. That is why in this video I will let you know which are my top 5 headphones. Place number 5 we have the cable headphones that you get basically when you buy any kind of phone. These are the most common standard headphones that you get everywhere. These one are from the big bus tour that I took I don't remember whether in Vienna or in Oslo. I just keep them with me because they actually work well. They are the type of headphones that goes inside your ear. They work very well actually, I really like them. I am an iPhone user so I have the standard headphones from Apple and I really like them actually. They are cool, they are nice. I always have one pair with me, I keep them in these little case because otherwise they get tangled. These type of headphones are actually pretty useful still because you don't have to check if they are loaded, if they have enough battery and they don't consume any battery when they are attached to your phone. So I always always have one of these with me. At place number four we have the JBL headphones with the cable cord. These ones are not wireless, they have the cable. I actually really like them because they are quite comfortable, they are very well padded, I think it's called, and they are pretty light thing that you don't have when you have wireless headphones, the battery is inside the headphones so they get quite heavy. Well, these are pretty light and for this reason actually they are less delicate I think than the one with the battery inside the headphones. I normally edit with these ones because still you don't have to charge them, you don't have to pay attention if the battery is full or not. They have a cable, they have the normal jack so I can actually plug it into my MacBook and I really like them actually, they are perfect size for my head. The main difference between these two types is that this one, they don't really stick inside your ear very well. So you actually have always to push them in, while with these you don't have this problem because you just put them on. At place number three we have my running headphones. These are so cool, I am so happy I found these. I have a little problem, my ears are quite small so these type of headphones do not really stick very well inside my ear, I always have to push it and when I run these annoy me so much because I always have the feeling that they are falling off but I don't have that problem with these little guys. These are actually amazing because you see they, this part goes inside the ear and these goes around the ear and this is the most amazing and fantastic thing. You put them like this around your neck and then you see this part goes inside the ear and this goes around the ear and believe me I can run, I can jump and this remains where it is. It is actually so cool, I really love them, I just bought another pair of them because I found a red pair for only 10 Swiss francs and I really love them, I, I think they're actually very well made, they're very useful so I think it's crazy that they cost only 10 Swiss francs. They are sweat resistant but they are not waterproof but I don't swim with them so it's fine. 
At place number two, we have the Bose. The case alone is actually very good. It's the only pair of headphones that I've ever had with such a cool case. If you open it, you have the headphones here. This is the jack for the airplane, which is actually the most useful thing. If you see, you can plug it in and watch the movies when you are on the airplane. And here I have the cable in case I want to plug them in and not use the wireless connection. I think it consumes a bit too much battery, so I prefer the plug-in headphones instead of the Bluetooth or wireless one. The feature that I love with these headphones is the noise cancelling. I normally use them when I am on a plane because really with the noise cancelling you don't hear anything. They are absolutely amazing, but they have a little problem. Do you see this? Why is Bose doing headphones only for people with big heads? This is unbelievable. I think the new model is a little bit better, but these are actually too big for me. I use them a lot when I go on a plane, but I wouldn't use them to just walk around because they're really too big for my head. Like, when you're on a plane, how can you sleep with such big headphones and your glasses and the pillow? And I'm like, Ugh. not very comfortable. Bose, you really need to solve this problem. It's impossible to sleep with the headphones on. Guys, I actually really miss this. At place number one, we have the AirPods. I really didn't want to buy them. I was really skeptical about them. I didn't really like it at first and I waited a very long time to buy the first pair, but I actually really had to admit that the AirPods are really super cool. I think the AirPods are really worth buying, but there is actually very big differences between the AirPods 1 and 2 and the AirPods Pro. And I will make a video only about the differences between these two, so stay tuned for the next video. Remember to subscribe to my channel and to give this video a thumb up and let me know which type of headphones you use and let me know if you have any other brands which makes headphones that is really worth trying. So stay tuned for the next video and see you next week. Bye!